I did the winners, so here are my biggest losers in the NBA draft. The older college bigs fell far and hard. Trace barely got drafted, and then the rest went undrafted. Oscar, Azul, Tabellas, Castleton, Sonogo. Dame is going to have a very tough choice to make in Portland. They're picking a lot of young guys. They're building for the future. They say they want to win with him, but the team isn't close to being a contender. I don't have an issue with the Magic taking Anthony Black at six. I like him. I like the pick. It does crowd their backcourt a little. Taking Jet Howard as their wing shooter in the lottery over Grady is definitely questionable. And they made a terrible trade sending pick 36 away for virtually nothing when it should be a good value. Cam Whitmore slotting from top five consideration to 20 is really tough and it's going to lose him about $10 million over the next three years. Ryan Repair was super happy and emotional to get drafted. Of course, it's awesome. But being invited to the draft as a green room attendee and slotting to the second, let alone pick 43 is definitely tough. Chris Livingston questionably stayed in the draft of the deadline. He even started shutting down team workouts as he got drafted and Rich Paul apparently wanted him to go to a certain spot after probably needing to go back to school for at least another year. Going last pick in the draft is definitely a tough look.